running means it, it's escapism. It's a release, a way to it's um, entertainment. escape, a way to sort of just come back to the basics. I think that running's at, uh, it's at the core of humanity. I think that so um, frustrating. It's what we're designed to do as beings, and it is apart from it's other parts I love of doing. my life, it's probably the biggest part of my life. first inspired when I watched the Olympics, I watched Brendan Foster. Foster the man now, who comes home in 13 minutes, 16, 17, Foster the gold medal for Britain. And I thought I'd like to do that. I think Bryanson running is completely on an upward sort of spiral. We've got our amazing group of coaches, we've got lots of enthusiastic people as well coming from all age groups. And also like I just think like there's so many young years who are so up for it, so ready for it. And I think now that COVID's all blown over, like they have the opportunity to do what they want to do and they can just excel. It's just very exciting. <laughs> I'm one of the coaches in the, one of the uh, cross-country squad. Really what I do is I, I write a plan and typically what we'll do is uh, they'll probably run three times a week. We'll typically do a tempo session, uh, a hill session, um, probably combined, and then we'll do a speed session and then at the weekends they'll probably do a nice easy run just to try and get the balance. Dave has been such a good asset to the team because he's really like structured the team. He's all about the individual which is at the core of running and actually with that mentality we've been able to achieve so much. Go James! Go James! Yeah, there's lots of pressure on us all nowadays to be everything to everybody and I think that where running really helps is it teaches you that yes you will get through it Yes, you will have bad days, but you will have good days. And it doesn't matter whether you're the best or whether you're the least able, it's individual. And so that learning is for everybody. And that's what I really, really like. Your greatest wins are for yourself and your greatest failures are for yourself, you know, and it both drive you um, to better things.